you have entered the Chronix rabbit hole. And John Doe, thank you so much for your YouTube membership request. We got Mrs. Giggles over here. We're having a great time. You're bringing Johanna Kirkula back down the rabbit hole, and she is singing Metallica's Nothing Else Matters. Thank you so much, John Doe, for this. I'm really looking forward to hearing Johanna Kirkula's version of Nothing Else Matters. Thank you so much, John Doe, for bringing Johanna Kirkula back down the rabbit hole. You let us know in a write-up that this song that Nothing Else Matters, this cover that she's done, she's doing it live for at, on a TV show for a charity event. So I'm really excited to see her variation of Nothing Else Matters. I believe I actually see her with a violin on screen right now. So I'm really excited to see what she's going to do, how this is going to sound. We've all heard Nothing Else Matters. So if you guys love the covers that have been coming down the rabbit hole, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Let us know what your favorite cover is in the rub comment section below and hit that notification bell so that you never miss a beat. I love you, honey. Metallica is one of my favorite bands of all time. Nothing Else Matters is the first song I actually learned on guitar. So this one holds deep in my heart. One of my favorite songs to sing, so I'm going to keep my mouth shut because Johan's going to do way better than me. All right. You good? Yes. Okay. Ba no. done a nice little switch up here it's about halfway through i thought this was incredible because um it's really an acoustic um guitar song mm -hmm. so for them to start with the uh, violin then they had like the flute i guess mm -hmm. and they actually have a guitar there so that's why i think it's amazing that they're making it more um what would you call it it's not concert like um like orchestra i guess or yeah um it's just a, a complete different vibe and this is really nice because you can see like 
people are donating this is obviously for charity this is a perfect song they have the people in the background where it's showing maybe some of the kids that it's going to or all that like shuffling through all the images there mm -hmm. so it's just such a it's a perfect amount because it's four minutes and 48 seconds so it's a shorter version of the song so they cut out some of the unnecessary parts so we can just hear johanna sing this yeah. so amazingly and like she's got such a beautiful voice and i also something that i've been focusing on because i thought she was wearing like a really pretty polka dotted dress or like something with flowers on it oh but it actually has skulls and crossbones oh it's skulls and crossbones yeah so she's wearing a black dress with skulls and crossbones all over it right. and so she's like still super metal yeah but, like super pretty and adorable and yeah. cute all at the same time it's pretty amazing and so it? like she is such at the perfect juxtaposition of herself in here because she's singing for a charity of event yeah in a concert style of a metallica song wearing this cute little like almost like a tea party dress that's covered in skull and crossbones it's amazing and it makes me so happy i mean she's tuamas's wife for she, a reason yeah there's oh. she's got you can see that she's got like a personality to her that yeah. is more than what anyone would expect on like just seeing this for a first time yeah 100%. right so like she's got she's got so much I think Nothing Else Matters is one of the best songs ever genre list. Like it's, I think it can fit in any genre and yes. it's nice to see how it can be extrapolated into something like a classical. It's, it's, that's kind of what I was saying. This is feeling like a classical music song now, a post yeah. metal song. And that's beautiful because it really is that good. So like classical style, singer songwriter style versus yeah. like a metal. Yeah. I get that. What's incredible about this performance we had just heard the warning a mexican band that did a cover for enter sandman and it was very like classical but then it turned into rocky at the end there so that's why this was like a straight classical song yeah. for this cover and i thought that was amazing um johanna herself is like her voice is so incredible. I we gotta check out Ori more with the her um like the band that she has with Tuamas and yes. Troy. Um, it just makes me want to see more from her. So thank you so much, Chondo, for bringing this because I love Metallica. I love Johanna. The perfect combination there is for a good cause. She did justice. I mean, there you go, right? Yeah, that was that was a phenomenal cover, and like it was so soft, like it was such a soft spoken v version of this one. Yeah, and it was like, 
It's the perfect song that you would sing in this way. Like you said, the song is genre-less. Yeah, oh because yeah. Because it can be sung in so many different genres. It is a song that you can just sing to in the car. You can sing to it in the shower. You can sing to it with a piano. You can sing yeah. to it with an electric guitar. Yeah. And listening to her beautiful, beautiful voice with this song is just something else. And like before we even started recording, I was like, you know... It's amazing because Johanna has such a beautiful voice and who almost would never marry someone who couldn't sing his music. <laughs> yeah, right. Then hearing her come out with this and I'm just like, oh my God. Because I know oh. Tuomas loves Metallica too. And I yes. like what I'm starting to realize is everyone loves Metallica. Everyone just loves just Metallica. growing up and it's songs like nothing else matters that transform them to just juggernauts around the world where anyone can sing it and do a, an amazing performance like this absolutely i mean like my youth pastor loved metallica when i was a kid like, yeah see there you go right like we would be listening to metallica going down to the church and it's like wait this feels like a contradiction <laughs> but no like worries, everyone right? loves metallica yeah and so like this was this is amazing i love that she did this especially for a charity event and like everyone was just loving it like just there you saw that guy in the back yeah was, what was he holding um i think they were like rings or something but oh. like i noticed that in this tv show because this was 2008 as well but the tv show they had a red dot as like their little logo so it would go across the screen to like oh. reveal the number that you could text to like donate okay and yeah. i'm pretty sure because i was wondering what he was holding as well and i think those were like rings or like something that had to do with that red dot that the tv show had so that's what I'm assuming. I could be entirely wrong, but right. that I'm not sure what he was holding. Who knows? But who knows? I didn't realize Metallica was getting covered so much. So that makes me happy because yeah. I've already heard all these songs. So it's nice to get these first time reactions with y'all where it's songs I do know I'm already going to like, but it's completely a different style. So mm -hmm. I'm always looking forward to that. So if you guys know more Metallica covers or just more Johanna songs that you want us to check down, let us know in the comments below. Like if you had a good time with us. Subscribe if you are new to the channel and you want more because we are leaving now. Sorry, folks. Thank you so much for being here. And thank you, John Doe, for this amazing Johanna song, this cover. We absolutely loved it. Peace and love, everyone. God bless you. Take care and bye for now. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more Enter the Chronicness. Special thanks to all of our YouTube, Patreon, and Buy Me a Coffee members. Thank you for all of your support.